I have made it my mission to help you get a better style, so if you're one of those people who are looking at your closet every morning, not being able to figure out what to wear, then you need an outfit uniform and I'm going to help you find your own personal outfit uniform so that you can dress your best every single day. And especially for those days when you have nothing to wear. Hi, my name is Marie, and if you don't know me, my videos are all about making fashion make sense, so if that sounds good to you, you should definitely subscribe and follow my socials link below. Now let's get into what an outfit uniform really is. So an outfit uniform is basically an outfit formula that you can wear on repeat in different versions, and the purpose of having one or several different outfit uniforms is so that you can always rely on them to look and feel your best. I personally love an outfit uniform, especially for those days when I just don't have the energy to to try and figure out what to wear, but I know that I need to look good and put together, so I would recommend to develop around three to four outfit uniforms that you can rotate between for whenever you're in a styling rut. Outfit uniforms can also be referred to as a signature style, and many people adopt a style uniform as a way of streamlining their wardrobe and simplifying their dressing routine, but it can also be used to express your personal identity. For example, if you look at some of the people who are considered the most fashionable, most of them will have a signature style style that you associate them with, and some of them even just wear the same outfit in different variations on repeat, which I'm going to give you lots of examples on later on in this video. Now you might be wondering, isn't a signature style or an outfit uniform just the same as a personal style? Well I see personal style more as a broader term and a reflection of your fashion style, whereas an outfit uniform is a more consistent set of clothing items that you wear regularly. So basically you can create an outfit uniform or a signature style out of your personal style, if that makes sense. Both are important, but a personal style is something that you have to develop over time, and an outfit uniform is something that you can create today out of your existing wardrobe. And this is the easiest, most simplest step that you can do to dress better with clothes you already own, because creating an outfit uniform doesn't have to be complicated at all, and you don't need a thousand different layers or accessories to create a really stylish outfit. Now I'm going to show you some examples of celebrities that have been coined fashion icons by the media just to show you how easy it really is and give you some inspiration on how you can create your own personal uniform. So Victoria Beckham for example relies on a knitted turtleneck and belted loose trousers. So this is definitely more of a seasonal uniform that's more suited for maybe fall, winter, and maybe early spring. But you can also really easily adapt this uniform to different seasons by maybe switching out the knitted material to cotton, which is thinner and more breathable for warmer weather. Or you can switch out the trousers for some high-waisted structured shorts, just so that you get the same effect as the high-waisted trousers. You could also completely switch out the top for a tank top, but still keep the high neckline. And this is an outfit uniform that Rosie Huntington Whiteley always falls back to, and this is definitely a bit more summer appropriate. And as you can see, she really just wears basically the same outfit but in different neutral colors. She's also styled them with different accessories and shoes to switch things up. Then we have Emily Ratajkowski who also loves a turtleneck but paired with blazer, jeans, and boots. I think this is such a fashionable look that it's just super stylish but it's really just built with basic pieces so it's super easy to recreate. You can see that she's really built out her blazer collection and that's another point that I wanted to bring up. Once you have an outfit uniform that you always wear, not only is that going to make your dressing routine much easier, but it's also going to make shopping a lot easier. Because you'll know exactly what clothing pieces and silhouettes that you like to wear. Then we have another fashion icon. Hailey Bieber often wears a cropped t-shirt with baggy jeans and a leather jacket. I have a feeling that this is her casual go-to for when she's just out and about, because it looks really on trend and stylish, but I can also imagine it being super comfortable. Then we have another pretty basic basic outfit uniform by Elsa Haas. She loves to wear a blue button-up with blue jeans, typically styled with brown accessories. This is such a simple business casual look that strikes the perfect balance between casual and dressed up, and she's really switching it up with her accessories, which is a way you can make your outfit uniform more fun and personable. Then we have Kendall Jenner, who also loves her basics, and she often wears a white tank top or t-shirt paired with jeans as a base, and then it's styled with different layering pieces. But last 
summer, she also wore a sweater vest with belted straight leg jeans or trousers as one of her staple uniforms. So this is also an example of when you love something, you buy it in multiple colors and patterns. Then we have Bella Hadid who often stays very on trend. So finding an outfit uniform example for her wasn't as easy, but I did find one. And I found that she's often caught in a turtleneck, belted jeans, and a leather jacket that's sometimes styled with a white button-up underneath. So it's pretty safe to say that most people that love fashion have an outfit uniform that they know that they can rely on. And this is also proof that you don't always have to reinvent the wheel to look your best self. So don't overcomplicate things and remember that there's nothing wrong with being an outfit repeater. So now it's time for you to pick your own outfit uniform and the first thing you need to do is identify your personal taste of what you like and don't like to wear. This is where outfit uniforms and personal style kind of becomes intertwined because if you're unsure about what you like and don't like on yourself, it's going to be much harder to create an outfit uniform that you're actually going to stick with and can rely on to look and feel your best because that's essentially the whole point of this that you feel empowered and good in what you wear. So these need to be outfit uniforms that you know that you're always going to look good in no matter what. I would suggest that you start by identifying a few key pieces from your wardrobe that you already know that you love and typically wear to serve as the starting point for your outfit uniforms. And as I mentioned in the beginning, you want to create a few different outfit combinations just so you can keep things fun and fresh and also have options. So some of these pieces that you pick you can actually use for several outfit uniforms so don't think that you can just use one item for one outfit uniform. Actually, the more versatile your pieces and your wardrobe is, the better. Now, I would focus on the proportions and the silhouettes to further build my outfit uniform. And if you want to learn how to build a balanced outfit, by the way, I have all the information in this video, which you can watch after this one. But if you already know what kind of proportions and silhouettes that you like, you can start by picking out one of your key pieces. So let's say this blazer, for example. So I know that I personally prefer straight leg trousers with my blazer because that makes my silhouette look more balanced. I also know that I like to wear a tight fitted top under my blazers because that's just more comfortable to me. And I also prefer a high neck top over a low cut top paired with a blazer but not a turtleneck because that makes me feel a little bit too closed up. So then I can come to the conclusion that a high neck t-shirt or a high neck tank top will probably suit this outfit uniform the best according to my personal style preference. And with these jeans I also know that I'm I'm gonna have to wear a heeled boot because the hem of these jeans are a little bit longer and I specifically chose these jeans because they're a little bit flared at the bottom which I think balances out the shoulders of this blazer really nicely. It's kind of difficult to guide you personally through this process because your outfit uniform should be tailored to you and your personal style preferences but I hope that walking you through my thought process at least helps a little bit. So let's take another example, but let's start with my favorite black trousers instead. So for this outfit uniform, I'm going to pair the trousers with a black tube top and I'm choosing the tube top because it is a clothing piece that I wear all the time and I just love of shoulder tops and I'll take any excuse not to wear a bra. Now I want to spice up this look with a layering piece, but I don't want to choose something structured this time because I already had the structured blazer in my last uniform. So I'm going to go with this silky button-up shirt instead and to make the outfit more interesting I'm gonna add a belt and my heeled boots again but if I want to keep it more casual I can also switch out the boot for a black sneaker. I think the best way to really create your outfit uniforms is just to go and try different combinations on from your wardrobe. Maybe even test them out in real life and see how you feel. You're gonna have to take some time and it's going to be a process but trust me once you have your outfit uniform you'll never have to stress about what to wear again. Now that you've picked out your outfit Outfit uniforms, I just want to give a few tips on how to stay excited about them and not get bored, which I feel like not many people address in these kind of videos. And the whole point of this is that you stick with it and are able to wear these outfit formulas on repeat. So if you have a few outfit formulas that you love, I would either go the Emily Ratajkowski or Kendall Jenner route, or I would go the Elsa Hosk route. So let me explain. So either build out your collection of pieces that you love and repeatedly wear, like Emily Ratajkowski did with her blazer or what Kendall Jenner did with her sweater vest. Because if it is something that you actually wear often, it's totally going to be worth it to get a few versions of that clothing piece because you know that it will blend seamlessly with your personal style and your signature look. This is also the perfect time for you to experiment with different textures in your outfit uniform and try out new color combinations. And you might even 
even discover new pairings that you haven't even thought of before. Then you can also go the Elsa Hosk route, where you instead invest in different accessories and shoes, which you can use to spice up your outfit uniform and make it more exciting. This is the route that I typically tend to go because I just love bags and shoes. And you don't even need a lot, having a few accessories to rotate between is enough. So for example, maybe you have a set of brown accessories, a set of black accessories, a set of silver jewelry, and a set of gold jewelry. And just with that, you already have a lot to work with. Besides experimenting with accessories, you can also switch out your layering pieces or incorporate a new element like a statement piece or a statement accessory into your outfit. I hope that you found this video helpful and if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you like this video. It helps me out a lot. And follow my socials linked below for daily fashion inspiration. And see you in the next video. Bye!